by changing the electrical environment of a regenerating fragment, they can switch between normal head tail planaria and planaria that have two heads. On one head on each side. Yes. Nothing to do with changing the genome or anything like that. So they make this bioelectric change. These two-headed planaria breed true. So they regenerate as two-headed forever as far as we can tell. What were the instructions to make a planaria with two heads? If it's not in the gene, later on... It's, it, it's being stored in, in effectively the electric field of the planaria. But it's stored in the bioelectric field of the cytoplasm of the animal. It's amazing. Yeah. So the animal didn't readjust to its environment, kept the electric change. Right. And, then- and you can actually switch it back to one-headed again by making a bioelectric change. It remembers that change too. If the environment doesn't have an electric change, you can assume after a certain number of... The change actually appears to be permanent.